Good morning, dear friends. This is Lady Sylvia. And boy, it's March 4th, the beginning of another week. And it's uh, the weather's been pretty nice. And it's been uh, in this almost 70 here. So that's really wonderful. Kind of tired of the cold weather. And my knees are telling me so. Anyway, I went out thrift shopping yesterday. Didn't find a lot, but I found some fabulous pieces. This is really heavy, heavy cobalt blue glass. Take a look at that. With old antique brass spacers, those are old. I love the combination of the yellow and the blue, don't you? And then at the bottom, look at these beautiful lampwork beads. And these um, rhinestone rondelles, that's really cool. It's so sparkly and super heavy. So these are definitely not plastic. They are glass. Cobalt's one of my favorite glasses. I just love those. And then I found this with uh, definitely faceted crystal um, and art glass. Love these rectangles. And black faceted glass. Look how that sparkles. Again, very heavy. I'm, I, I think this is uh, either Czech or Venetian, or a combination of both. These might be Venetian. And um, either rock crystal. I'm really suspicious. I think these are rock crystal. They're really heavy and beautiful. And it has an old box clasp. I'm not sure if it's sterling, but it looks like it. And then I found... Uh, this garnet cross, that's really beautiful. It is marked 925 right in the back there. It's very, very beautiful. And then I found a sterling angel and you guys know I love my angels. So I, I think she's kind of cute with her lopsided halo. And then I found this which is by an artist called Michelle Golan. And apparently she is from uh, Israel and lives in New York City. And those pieces, very, very Victorian looking. You can wear it as a, um, a pendant or a pin. And it's signed right there, Michelle Golan. And these pieces here, I thought at first were mother of pearl, but they look a lot like amylite which is a um, gemstone uh, that, that I think is patented in Canada. Um, and they find it off of ammonites, which are uh, fossilized creatures. Let me show you an example of that. Uh, many years ago, I made this piece. Look at this giant ammonite. Ammonites were similar to nautilus, uh, the nautilus creature with the, you know, he has little tentacles sticking out there. These were actually air chambers, and over the millions of years, this, this, these things are 400 million years old. Incredible. I beat it all around it using Swarovski crystal. And uh, anyway, these were air chambers, and they get filled in with uh, silica and sediments, and. Um, I just love the caramel tones and this. They're all different. I have a ton of them. They're all, all different. And now look at this, the way that, that fire of red, that's uh, the opalized am amylite, which they harvest from these ancient fossils. Look at that fire. See, it's up there too. It depends on how you hold it to the light. And, and the mineral silica gives all opals their, their fire, whether it's moonstone, labradorite, um, black opal, white opals. It's the silica that gives it that, that unusual shine. Anyway, so um, that's what I think this is, because it has a usual, it's usually that sort of greeny, see the fire of a little bit of red there? Anyway, I thought that was really incredible. I loved it and thought I have to have it to my pin collection. Anyway, my friends, 
I hope you're having a, a wonderful day. I hope that this week brings you lots of uh, wonderful surprises and blessings. And I really thank you for liking, sharing, and subscribing. It means so much to me. And you guys are the greatest. Love you all. Take care. God bless. Bye-bye.